my brother was a huge fan of the books when, when we were younger, and he used to um, be so scared of them. He'd read them before bed, but then he used to have to freeze the book because he just didn't want the monsters to attack him. I'm guessing is the logic. Um, what do you mean he would like literally put it in the refrigerator? He'd literally put the book in, in the freezer, <laughs> which actually reminds me, because Joey from Friends does that in an episode as well. But anyway, I want to do, thought, we play a little game. Are you game yeah. for a game? Yeah, I'm game. I've got some pictures. I've come organized. Um, yeah. So basically, I want you to rate from one to Freezer some of the monsters from the movie. And Freezer is the most scary, obviously, because it's like belongs in the freezer. Okay. Okay. So we're gonna obviously have to start with Slappy. I can't believe you're starting with Slappy. We have to start with Slappy. Ten. Absolute freezer. Put that dummy in the freezer. <laughs> Stop. He's kind of cute though. Yeah, he's cute. He just has a really bad case of Napoleon. Syndrome, I think. Exactly. He's got a Napoleonic complex, but he's also just pure evil. He's the mastermind. He's the most brilliant. He's always a step ahead of you. That's what makes him so scary. But do you kind of feel like if he just was given a pair of Cuban heels, the whole film would just not stand because then he wouldn't have the whole Napoleon complex thing? Oh, would. I thought you meant because he'd be so sexy. Oh, and that as well. Because he'd be tall and he wouldn't have the complex. Whatever floats your boat. That might be the, the secret weapon against him. Maybe that's what kind sequel. of heels were they again? Cuban heels. Oh, Cuban. Do they have the best heels? Well, they're, no, they're basically like high heels, but for men. Oh. Yeah. I need to get me a pair. Yeah. Well, next time maybe they have them in London. Do some shopping here. Yeah. Um. Okay. Second of all, the abominable snowman. Uh. Well, he's up there. Yeah. Uh, I'm not gonna give him the ten. No one else can have the ten. Uh. But I'm gonna give him a solid seven and a half. Why not eight or nine? Because he's also kind of like snuggly. Yeah. But he, he, yeah, he's giant, the most muscular of all the monsters. I have to feel that, I have to agree with you, like the, when he started eating sweeties, I was like, automatically you're quite relatable, yeah. so less scary. And you know how to stop him. Yeah. Just throw some M&Ms at his exactly, feet. Exactly, some Skittles or something. Exactly. And just one final one, the gnomes. Oh, those dudes are, yeah, those are a solid nine. Because although they also are cute, uh, they're unstoppable. Mm. You can destroy them. You think you destroyed them. They just put themselves back together again. Uh, and yeah. they did try and roast you like a chicken, which exactly. was not ideal. Yeah. It was kind of a, a call back to um, Gulliver's Travels, if you saw that. Yeah. The tiny people tying me up and having their way with me. Some more Cuban heels for them as well. Exactly. <laughs> Thank you so much. High five. No. Oh, high five. No. Okay. <laughs>